Wyman from St. Timothy's Lutheran Church, yep. and she is actually the, I'll say, the godmother of this of this event. She brought it to the Saints, and it's something that you guys have been doing for a while. So my question for you tonight is, what has the invention of the indoor toilet done for your life? For my life? Personally, yes. It makes winners of Minnesota bearable. He's the general manager of the St. Paul Saints. We have one question for him tonight. What is, uh, what's been the biggest impact of the, the creation of the indoor toilet on your life? When you have to run out back, every now and then you get the, uh, we have mulch. And, okay. You know, it saves me a lot of time. I don't have to put the shoes on to avoid getting the mulch in between my toes. So, Carlo, what do you think this game would have been like with the uh, outdoor toilets? Well, that's what they have here is outdoor toilets. <laughs> <laughs> With the invention of the indoor toilet, how has that impacted your life? <laughs> I still haven't gotten up to that level of technology yet. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Can I ask you something? We're, uh, we're co-sponsoring the event tonight, the, um, the toilet paper drive. So we're just here to ask you about um, what the invention of the indoor toilet has meant to your life. Tonight, celebrating Thomas Crapper Night and the invention of the indoor toilet. We're here with two green shirt guys tonight. And uh, you got to put your arms around each other, get close. So what has, we're, we're talking about the invention of the indoor toilet. What has the invention of the indoor toilet meant to your lives? Asking uh, fans here tonight, um, since we're celebrating Thomas Crapper Night and the invention of the indoor toilet, um, what has that invention meant to your life? The in invention of the indoor toilet has meant to your life. Oh, great invention. I love it. We're off in South Dakota. The kids all had to use the outhouse anyhow. Only the adults got the indoor facility. All right. I ask you about what the significance of the invention of the indoor toilet has meant to your um, life. Um, it's done a lot of things for me in my life. You know, taking good care of me. I like the padded seat personally. Yeah. Uh, with the wood cover, though, of course. Obviously, lumber. <laughs> okay. Anyways, I use it probably what three, four times a day. So awesome. So what can you tell me about what's the uh, creation of the indoor toilet meant for you? Comfort, convenience, uh, privacy, and a place to be. We're here with Susan and Michelle. Michelle, and we are here to celebrate the 100th anniversary of the invention of the indoor toilet. Yes. Can you guys share a little bit about what that invention has made to your lives? It's made a world of difference. No more chopping out the snow to the outhouse. Because you remember before we used to have indoor toilets. Yeah. yeah. What do you have there with the, in the plungers? Do you drink out of those? Can I? Can I? Look at all this toilet paper. Say that people don't give a crap. All right. Now we're gonna light them on fire. <laughs> 